There is always drama being stirred up with the Kardashian sisters. Whether it comes to Kylie's controversial private jet ownership, or Chloe's edited photos, the sisters are never far from the spotlight. That is the reason why they have strict rules around who gets to come into their personal circle of friends and staff. Here are five things that Kardashians ban their inner circle from doing. Point 1. You cannot hook up with any of their exes. When Kylie Jenner's former best friend was accused of kissing Khloe Kardashian's boyfriend Tristan Thompson back in 2018, she was immediately dropped from the family's inner circle. Woods and Thompson were accused of being all over each other at a party, though Woods later claimed Thompson kissed her and she did not reciprocate. The sisters did not hold back and drag Woods online and on their show, something Kylie even had to call them out for. One thing the episode taught us is that the sisters will not tolerate breaches of the girl code. 2. Talking about their personal lives to the public is off limits. In 2019, a source told People that Woods had signed an ironclad NDA with the Kardashians. This was after the announcement that she would go on to the Red Table talk with Jada Pinkett Smith to discuss the situation. The source explained that she can't talk about the family, so it's unclear what she's going to be able to say to Jada. She can apologize but can't talk about anything really beyond that in terms of the family. Kim even confirmed how much emphasis the family puts on privacy agreements in a 2019 tweet. Point 3. You can't be shady about any business deals. The Kardashians have been known to sever ties with employees and close friends that speak about any of the business to the press. This was probably one of the reasons the Kardashians booted longtime makeup artist and friend Joyce Benelli from their inner circle. In 2018, a source who was close to both parties told People that Benelli tried to go around them on a deal so the Kardashians wouldn't make money off of it. They caught on and Kim stopped following her, but Chloe and Joyce remained amicable. Point 4. Their partners come first out Sometimes being a good friend means calling out their partner's bad behavior but the Kardashians don't agree. In fact, the sisters try to listen to their men's opinions and use that to make cuts in their friend groups. That was reportedly the reason behind Larsa Pippen, Kim's longtime friend, getting dropped from her friend group. I just feel like Kanye was in a place where he really didn't trust anyone with Kim, Pippen said during an interview with Dax Holt and Adam Glynn on their Hollywood Raw podcast. Pippen believes that West was angry about her blocking his number and started badmouthing her to Kim along with the rest of the family. The Kardashians, all started to ride his wave. If you're that easily swayed, like the wind. Then do I really give a f? I don't know. Dot was I hurt by it? Yes. But at the same time, I'm like, I've done nothing. I've never done one thing. I've been the most honest and truthful best friend to all of them, Pippin said. Dot five. You can't steal the spotlight. Kim Kardashian's longtime assistant, Stephanie Shepard, had worked for her since 2013, but was dropped when she began getting too close to Kourtney Kardashian and building a following of her own. In 2017, a source revealed to People that Steph went from being an assistant to being a celebrity. Dot for a regular girl, she has a huge social media following. She loves the attention, but it took away from her job. There was a feeling that being Kim's assistant, Steph should stay more in the background. But Kim is the one who helped her get the followers by posting pictures with Steph, 